It's the next day. I'm working on the sump tank. I'm getting it all ready for the uh, waterbed to go around it. I've got the framing wood, but uh, that'll come later. But for now, I have to do a concrete pour over there. You can see that I've created the framework. Uh, if we come in a little bit closer, you should be able to see the mesh. Um, I've got the level on the access uh, pit. Now that has to be dead level. You've got to remember that the waterbed is going to, that's going to be coming out through the centre of the waterbed. Now so it has to be dead level because the water is obviously going to be dead level. So that's really critical. So the noise in the background you can hear is the uh, cement mixer going, uh, going for it. Where are we? Can't see through the light. There it is. So you're going to see shortly that that concrete pour is going to happen. Um, now, why is the sump tank under the waterbed? Well, basically because where the wheelbarrow is, is going to be the new edge of our house. From that limestone pole uh, through to, hopefully the light's okay, to that corner of the house, we're going to have a new wall, well actually windows, looking out over the pond. So, and obviously in the foreground there is where the waterbed's going to be. So we need to have a concrete uh, layer over there because basically water is really heavy. One uh, cubic metre is one ton. Um, yeah, so you'll see that shortly.